Hey everyone, if you want to get Ariana Grande's complete look, hair, makeup and all, then I suggest you keep on watching. Starting with a fresh face, I definitely have to moisturize, so I'm going to use my Jergens Natural Glow Medium to Tan Tone. This basically is a daily moisturizer, but gives you a gradual color. Next, my Amazing Cosmetics Velvet Mineral Liquid, just to even out my skin tone. Now adding my bronzer, NARS, in Casino. Now I'm adding my Urban Decay eyeshadow primer to begin this Ariana look. Next, I'm going to use my Kat Von D True Romance Eyeshadow Palette in Saints. The first color I'm going to use is Sunny, and that's basically like a pearlized gold. We're using this color to achieve Ariana's really natural eye look. Next, in the same palette, we're going to use Caravaggio, which is a dark matte brown. We're going to start by drawing an arc from the inner corner of your eyelid to the outer corner of your eyelid, making sure that the arc is slightly above your own crease. Ariana has big beautiful eyes and this is going to help us achieve that look. Next, I'm going to blend it all in with my blending brush. I'm going to apply the soft pink with a little sparkle to my brow bones. Using my Maybelline Master Duo Liquid Eyeliner, I'm going to apply the eyeliner from the inner corner of my eye to the outer corner of my eye and nothing more. Now I'm going to apply my blush, my Tarte Amazonian Clay. Now I'm going to use my Too Faced Size Queen Mascara. Here I'm going to use my Maybelline Define Line on my waterline. For my lips, I'm going to use my MAC Frost Lipstick in the color Bombshell. Ariana always has her signature light pink slash nude lips, so I thought this was perfect. Here I'm going to be using individual eyelashes as well as eyelash eyeliner glue. Everything about Ariana is done so naturally, but she does add some emphasis on her eyelashes. I'll be placing three individual medium sized lashes on the outer corner of my eyelids. And now we completed the makeup portion, but we're onto the hair. I've already washed and straightened my hair to make it more manageable for styling. So I'm just going to use a bobby pin instead of a tooth comb to make a part in the side of my hair. I'll be using the bobby pin to make another part by dragging it horizontally all the way down to the tip of my other ear. Now I'm going to make sure that I separate the rest of the hair from what I just sectioned off by tying it back. Mm -hmm. 
Now using my big sexy hairspray, I'm going to make sure I spray all the flyaways and all the pieces are flat down. Starting from the top, I'm going to grab the hair and I'm going to just twirl it down and as I go down, I'm going to make sure that I grab the rest of the pieces of the section that I sectioned off. After I secured it with a bobby pin, I'm going to hairspray it down. Now I'm going to let the rest of my hair loose and I'm going to start to make a half up, half down part. And now to secure it with a hair tie and some more hairspray. I'm going to start to curl my hair with my 1 inch Hot Tools curling iron. I'll begin by placing my curling iron at the bottom of my hair and rolling upward. Make sure to not roll your curling iron all the way up. You want about 2 inches of difference between your scalp and the wand. And now to curl the ponytail. Ariana always has such cute bows in her hair, so we're going to add a bow to make the look even better. And to top off the look, you have to find the perfect Ariana dress. She actually has one very similar to this. It is exactly the same pattern, just a different shape. Hope you enjoyed this look. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to check the links below. Bye guys!